Five dollars now for my throat and cough. Got um, all the cold. Worst well, time for me because um, I'm ten week. Well, not ten weeks. Ten days out for my boxing match. So if you guys don't already know, I got my, a boxing match coming up in ten days, which I've been training absolute bollocks off for it. So yes, yeah, so, so that you guys know. But no, yeah. Last night when I ended the video, I went to Halfords uh, to get myself an air, not air filter. Is it the oil filter, is it? Yeah, but it, yeah, oil filter. That's in the house on my house. Uh, I'm not doing that today, I'm doing that to Saturday with my dad, so my dad can help me out. But now I'll insert the clips now. Yes, lads. <clears throat> Trying to pop to Halfords, so I might as come with me. Because I need to do a. Hang on, light in. Because I need to do a oil change, really, on this car. I haven't done it for about. 5,000 miles, so it's up for a change. So I'm gonna pop to Halfords now, get an oil filter. Already got the oil anyway, so my dad's mate gets it for us. So thank you to him. Yeah, like with me exhaust, it's allowed outside, but inside it's not too bad. But it start, it's when I start putting my foot down, it, that's when it gets really loud inside. Like you're probably about to hear it. On my camera, but like, yeah, but like, I'll pull off in first now, it's about 4,000 revs. Like, that's when it picks up the loudness, we get to about 4,000 revs. Yeah, I just reckon because it is my air filter as well, my comb filter. I think if you boys know if you've got a Corsa at 3,500 revs, that's when the noise kicks in. So when I used to have a black box, I sort of used to penalise me for because the second gear, heart, three and a half hours, it's about 30 miles per hour. I always used to know. I always used to go over like four miles an hour. My foot is right down the street, bop, bop. <laughs> That's what done me. So boys, I got this from half as my filter. So that video will be up Saturday, Saturday like daytime, or whatever. Changing my oil, changing my oil filter as well, make it all clean. So I do do a lot of miles in this car, so I always want it clean. So man, you're gonna blow up. Touch wood. But no, now I need to just take my left driver passenger side wheel off because I'm getting this squeaky noise all the time. So. See my brake pads, or I'm just gonna give it a good clean. Or it could be paint on the clips. God knows, but maybe it's bloody charge it. Yeah, well, let's just give it a good clean, boys, and so what's what. Last time I did the, my brakes, took my wheel off and I done my brake, I ripped the skin off my fingers if you didn't know. Oh. Yeah, as you can tell, boys, well, I can tell you, you know, the Pop it dirty, so switch the camera for you guys. Look at that. Oh, that is shh, bloody, that's bad. So I'm gonna take all that off, pop, clean it, clean it down. But I just, just broke these the bolts. They weren't that tight, tight as the ones that were solid, so thank enough. But I'm gonna whack these off now. Ooh. 
Yeah, well, if you do take your brakes apart, all I'm saying is make sure you put them back to how it was because for so whatever reason you're braking and you ain't stopping, then don't come back to me because I'm not a mechanic. I'm just saying, obviously, obviously I'm doing my own brakes. Like. Top one. Yeah, I'll just normally use a Phillips screwdriver just to break the brakes off a bit because they all stuck onto the brake pads. It's on the bottom and the top, really. But never leave your brake <coughs> hanging by its wire like, so. Boys, look at the dirt on this. Oh my god. Mate, that is that is stupid. So yeah, I wanna some clip these out now. Slow paint on that side of the brake. I'm gonna get about 10 to 5 minutes. Perhaps dry and do another layout, then go into the big part of the brake. <clears throat> and yeah, because you see, like, my lack is peeling as well off that. Because when I bought the car, the geezer said to me, um, hasn't been a crash. But my dad noticed when we bought it, uh, the panels, different colours, a little bit in the sunlight. That's when my dad started thinking, but he took his word on it. Obviously, the months went on. Yeah, I reckon it's been a little bump. But any of you guys know anyone that you can get that fixed? You can't really see unless you're close up, so it, doesn't, it does bother me, but for the time being, it doesn't really. But any of you guys know anyone, please let me know. I want to get that sorted soon as. But yeah, guys, once I've done all this, I'll pick up the camera again. So I've just done that, boys. As you can tell, it looks way better now. Nice and fresh. Yeah, so. Yeah, so no, boys, this is a mad transaction to me sitting in the car in the night now, but got had some jobs to do for my mum and dad, so out to them. But now, um, tomorrow's video is going to be about my mate's BMW selling M Sports. So I'm going to bring that down to mine tomorrow. I want to do like a review on it for you guys to know. So if any of you guys are interested after tomorrow's video, just let me know, please. But yeah, um, stay tuned again. I'll upload that same time for tomorrow as well. But no, guys, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and peace.